or the starters. Number one, cute as a buck's ear, owned by Lynn Wilfong of Kentland, Indiana, trained by Brett Wilfong of Donovan, Illinois. The driver is Peoria native Sam Widger. Number two is M.A. Princess, owned by Hyla Dwarick of Lovington, trained by Irv Miller. Michael Osting is in the bike. Number three, Gum Corner Special, owned by Don Marinholtz of Chicago, by Ruth and Delbert Burkett of Ellery, trained by Delbert Burkett. The driver is Connell Willis. Number four, Mystical Brook, is owned by Tom Pollard of Danville, Dirk Simpson of Sherman, and Mystical Marker Farms of Chicago Heights, trained by Dirk Simpson. Dave McGee is up. Number five is Chasse, leased and trained by Quentin Wade Barbary of Salem, owned by Bill Gross of Louisville and Ann Gross Friedley. The driver is John David Finn. Number six, S.H. Revrack is owned by John Carver of Rock Island, by Irvin Miller of Springfield, Omer Miller of Arthur, and Dick and Barbara Cooley's Tanamira Farms of Felton, Delaware, trained by Irv Miller, Andy Miller in the bike. And number seven, Fox Valley Taboo is owned by Lloyd Arnold of Hartley, Delaware, trained by Tex Motes of Fairfield, Illinois. Tony Morgan is the driver. Post time in less than four minutes. Looking for five more qualifiers for Saturday's Shawnee Championship. Here they come for the fourth. They're off and trotting. SH Revrack and Chasse gun out for the lead together. And there goes Chasse getting to the front and angling over toward the inside rail. But M.A. Princess is there, and she will be a stubborn foe for the opening eighth of a mile. Chasse finally clears her, and M.A. Princess is off stride. SH Revrack clears the breaking trotter. And there goes Gum Corner Special to move up around her as well in the third. Cute as a bug's ear moves clear of trouble in the fourth position around the first turn. Then Mystical Brook, Fox Valley Taboo, and M.A. Princess is still off stride and is now trailing the field. 30 and 4 fifths was the time for the opening quarter. She's better than 25 lengths off the leader. Chasse has the lead by just one length. S.H. Revrack second by two. Gum Corner Special third. Cute as a bug's ear is off stride. There's a gap of two and a half lengths to Mystical Brook, who's closing that margin from fourth. Fox Valley Taboo moves up a closer fifth, and here comes S.H. Revrack to challenge for the lead. S.H. Revrack, challenge doesn't last long. It's over before they get to the half, and she's the new leader by a length and a half. Chasse goes second, Gum Corner Special third, Mystical Brook fourth, the half in 102 and four fifths. And then Fox Valley Taboo, a gap of three more to M.A. Princess, and a long way back to Cute as a bug's ear who, after making that break, is now trailing the field. Midway on the final turn, here comes Mystical Brook off the rail from the center of the pack, but they're all chasing S.H. Revrack by a length and a half. Chasse, second a half length. Mystical Brook is moving by her. Fox Valley Taboo in the outer flow of traffic, three lengths off the lead in fourth, moving around Gum Corner Special in fifth. And M.A. Princess, trying to grab the final transfer spot, moves up toward fifth on the outside now. Off three quarters, 134 and two fifths. S.H. Revrack leading Mystical Brook by a length and a half, moving into deep stretch. Final eighth mile for S.H. Revrack. Mystical Brook is next on the outside. M.A. Princess, Fox Valley Taboo moving the center of the track. S.H. Revrack, the leader by a length and a half. Mystical Brook is second. Chasse fights back toward the rail in third. Here's the line. S.H. Revrack, under no stress, wins it by a length and a half from Mystical Brook second. Close for third, either Chasse or Fox Valley Taboo in 2.03 and two-fifths. Still waiting for result of the photo for show on that fourth race. Into the winner's circle, here's the unofficial winner, number six, S.H. Revrack, Andy Miller, with the winning drive. Andy sharing some thoughts with his brother, trainer Irvin Miller, who's also the co-owner of this Cheyenne Spur filly, bred by Michael Van Dehede of Moline, John Carver of Rock Island, Irvin and Omer Miller, and Dick and Barbara Cooley's Tanamira Farms of Delaware are the owners. In the photo for show, number five, Chasse was third. Let's get a word with Andy Miller. Andy, first of all, this filly made a nice move at the half-mile mark. A couple of horses came at you at the head of the stretch. Next thing we knew, you were opening back up by length and a half. Did you really ever have to ask her for much in the stretch? 
No, not really. She was well within herself, and she loves when horses come at her, and she's real game and just loves to race that away. You had won the last three driving titles here at DeCoin until last year you lost the title by one win when Dave McGee won the final race of the week. You ready to give Dave a run for his money? Absolutely. <laughs> we knew that would be the answer. That's Andy Miller. Andy, congratulations.